What's happening everyone? It's Abdallah here bringing you guys another awesome Animal Crossing New Horizons video. This video is all about the Race for Raymond 2020. It's a very interesting concept. I got invited by the folks over at Crunchy Island in order to participate in a full island maze and if I'm able to make it through it, I'll be able to claim Raymond in boxes so that he can move into my town. How crazy is that? Now before we get started, I want to invite you guys to click on that subscribe button and turn on notifications so that you guys are updated on the latest and greatest Animal Crossing content. We've got tons of stuff such as tips and tricks tutorial videos, we've got the perfect run mayday guide, a feng shui guide, there's, there's a lot of awesome things happening on the channel so make sure you guys are all on board with it. Now I'll give you guys a little bit of rundown. Who the heck's Raymond and why should I care about him? Well. Apparently, in the Animal Crossing sphere right now, this cat with the two different colored eyes is the most sought after villager within the entire game, simply because there's no amiibo card that you can summon him in. There's over hundreds of different villagers, so the chance of you getting this guy is very, very slim to none. So people are spending so much in real life money for him, they're spending Nook Miles tickets, millions of bells in order to get this guy to move into the town. So that's kind of the trophy of this thing. Now, the folks over at Crunchy Island, I mentioned earlier, they invited me and three other people to participate in this island-wide maze. Now, whether or not I'm going to win or lose is up to you guys to find out. I wish uh, I can tell you, but I wanted to record my entire experience either way. Now this poster over here was a gift. I asked someone because I wanted to make this intro so you guys can see. Uh, this is definitely not anything that's exclusive to having him. You can spread these posters all over the place. So this is a gift. This is Raymond. And what we're going to do is I'm going to give you guys my live narrated gameplay of me talking out loud during this maze and then figuring it out. And am I the first one to get there? I don't know. I I don't know. You guys let me know in the comments. Those of you guys watching right now, please, in the comments, does Abdallah win or does he lose? Now, remember, we don't know who the competition is. We went into this completely blind. We know nothing about anything over here. And it was really interesting because um, the folks over at Crunchy Island said, hey, I'm coming over to your town. I'm dropping you 41 pieces of bubblegum to make your entire inventory all bubblegum. 41 meaning one more like in your mouth, so you can't really hide anything else. And then what we had to do is we had to go over to the island, the crunchy island, and then we had to drop it all just so that we can prove that we have nothing else in our pockets. And then once we're there, we're going to be suited up with a specific outfit if we really wanted to, and then we all lined up and then we just went at it. So without further ado, enjoy the video, stick around to the very end to see exactly who wins it, and then definitely give them congratulations because they did an awesome job. This was awesome. Truly, truly, the entire maze was great. So I'm not gonna spoil anything, but enjoy. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> We're all lining up. I guess I'm taking the stuff. All right. I like my pants though. Raymond's poster? Oh my gosh. Alright, I'm gonna organize this so it's all the way in the back. These are my high tops, so I'm not losing these. Hold on, take your positions? Where? Hold on, hold on, I'm not ready yet. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm really nervous. <laughs> The race for Raymond. All right, here we go. Focus. Okay, three, two, one. Holy moly, what in the world? Alright, can't lose my lead at the beginning. 
Oh! I don't know what they picked up. But I'm gonna be rolling across here, apparently. I don't know if it's a waste of time to pick up these DIYs or what, but I'm gonna try. Okay, this was um, interesting. What are these things? Just some random stuff I don't need? Okay. Well, this was interesting. Like, I need to get to like a crafting table or something. I'm trying to like collect some branches here, to be honest. Uh, I got four branches. I may need um, one more. So that's kind of my strategy with this. I don't really know what's going on over here. Okay, this seems to be a dead end that I'm probably gonna have to farm some wood for. And or a stone, so I gotta go back. Let's go, move, dude. That's a little shortcut. There's really nothing over here because I don't have a ladder yet. So jumping across that away, I don't know if I should be, to be honest. Let's go. See, now I'm yielding. Let's go. Jump. I need to see for myself what's going on over there. Like, why are they jumping back? Are they just not able to? Dead end, most likely? Yeah, like vaulting? Okay. So, since that's a dead end over there, I think I'm gonna need to go the opposite way and maybe find like a crafting table of sorts. I just gotta cover my bases. Like, that's the thing that I didn't do. So I'm going this way, going that way, and over and around. This doesn't allow me to do anything yet. This will, oh my gosh, I was gonna say if I can get up there, it can allow me to jump up on top of these little things. Is this not what I'm supposed to do here? Why is there a stairway? What's the point of me jumping over here? Yeah, absolutely nothing. There was no point in me doing that. I, I wasted big time for that. Yeah, I don't know. Okay, so that's kind of weird. I don't have a ladder or anything to climb that, nor do I have a shovel. That's a dead end. Alright, let's see, let's see. Like, how did this guy get over here?
Can you sell DIYs to Timmy and Tommy? Oh, it's roped off. Okay, so you can't. I was hoping you could, like, go over here and, like, sell these DIYs for some reason. I don't know why I need money, but I'm taking it. Okay, so this is where the camper is at. Oh, dang. Wah! Okay, so these are here for a reason. I have no clue what, but I mean, I better take it. Gosh! Maybe it's just like, yo, stop. Like, you don't have to be over here. Well, since I made it this far, I'm just gonna shake and see what we need. If you can't buy anything, then what's even the point? God, I'm wasting time! All right, I'm out, I'm out, I'm out. Okay, these guys are here. I don't know why I'm picking up these DIYs either. And I could jump across here? Okay, that's really nothing. There's no point in that. Wanna craft? I do wanna craft. Uh, yeah, but I don't have anything to craft. Like, I don't have a flimsy axe. Or a shovel. Like, I don't have anything like that. Nor do I have a stone. And this is a dead end. Hold on, is that a dead end? Hold on, what the heck? It's like, I don't have the pole either. Like, this is the end game over here, is where you get the crafting pole, right? So I missed a shovel somewhere. I missed, like, I missed a lot of things. I think I should not be here right now. I'm just gonna pick these up for the sake of it. And then there's a rock. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, roses? Hold on, what's that for? Dude, not a single tool to my name. Like, I got nothing. I just got my five branches needed for a flimsy. I probably missed something in the early stages of this maze. And I don't see anyone over here either. Which is making me a little nervous. So I rolled over here at the beginning, like, I don't know if this is what I needed to do. I'm completely lost. Like, no joke, there's stuff over there. I need to get to that stuff. It's like soft wood. So I need to, oh, I need to reverse engineer this? Are you kidding me? I gotta jump up there? Hold on, hold on. Oh my gosh. Okay, okay. I, I was on the right track with climbing up and then jumping across. And it looks like no one's got these tools yet. And the tool has to be a shovel or something. So I gotta go back over there, and I gotta climb up that, um... I have to climb that up. Oh, 
New! <laughs> like, let's go! So that was the one minor detail that I didn't see at the beginning, is that I needed to do that. And I really hope that that's kind of what I'm kind of working on here. Looks like this guy kind of figured it out. Right at the same time as I did. I wonder where shovels are? Nope, no hints, dude! Beautiful. Okay, first one. Stupid! I don't need this trash! I'm wasting my time! I need to actually, like... A present? What could- what could be wrapped up in the present? Nope! Uh, open? Ah, <sighs> stand mixer. Oh my gosh. Alright, here we go. So, I need to do something with the shovel now, and I don't really remember what. Because I need to get an axe. I got the tree branches. Where the heck- where am I going? Like, get out of here. How did I get over here? Oh my gosh, I'm getting real, like, frustrated here. <laughs> like, I don't want to give a hint that that's kind of what I got. Like, let me get out of here. It can't be all this trash on the ground. Oh, dang! A net? I don't need a net. Come on, man. Like, I don't need this. It's a waste of time. I guess if I rebury it, I should be all set, right? But I don't want to dig up my own stuff. So if I'm going to be a completionist about this, I have to actually dig up everything. And then remember what I buried, too. I don't need a net, though. Like, why was it a net? I can't I can't leave these unturned though. If one of them was a net, then something has to be. What? Oh my gosh, come on lag. So that rock does not net me anything. I think these are all just dumb things. I'm gonna go up to the top.
I don't remember how to get to that side, though. Like, you know, I'm gonna leave these two unturned, and then I'm gonna regret it, so let me just unbury these dumb things. Fax machine. Yo, forget that. Okay, so someone's jumping around. I'm I don't really have I don't really have that big of a head start because I'm wasting my time with this stuff. Come on, Sam, don't give it away, man. I don't know how to get back. Look, these are my tort. It's the same thing I dug out. I don't. I'm. I'm. I'm losing it, man. I'm losing it. I need to go back. I don't remember how I got up and over there. Here we go. Crunchy, race for Raymond. That doesn't do anything. Okay. You know, I don't think that any of these things are... These are, like, all time wasters. What? This is a dead-end one? This has to be something good. Dang it! The moment one of these, the, the moment one of these is going to be like the flimsy axe or something like that, because I'm going to need, I'm going to need wood. I'm going to go over here. I passed up like four of these things, so let me just hope and pray that there's something here, right? There's four. Check this out. It has to be something good. You can dig them all up. Why else would they be over here, right? Warm-up dance pants? Oh my gosh. I hope that me reburying these is actually making it harder for people. That's my only strategy here. Like I'm the I'm probably one of the only ones right now with the shovel, so I gotta figure this out. Nothing. Absolutely nothing right here. Like absolutely not. I've literally uncovered everything. <sighs> Did I even do this one? I don't remember anymore, man. I'm like getting, I'm getting like super nervous here. Shovel. You know what? I'm going to I'm going to forget that and we're going to go all the way over to where the villagers are at. Like need to craft. I'm going to go dig out all that junk. I think these are all fakes. So, if they're not fakes then whatever. I'm going back to the villagers. But I don't remember where the villagers were. Oh, the villagers were up and around, right? Yeah. Okay, so they were all the way in the bottom. Why does that say why does it say race for Raymond right there? Okay, that was pointless. Okay, I'm gonna go to the villagers and it says like, wanna craft something? Yeah, I do. And then I gotta make it, ba make it all the way back. 
Okay, that's not gonna net me anything. Get this guy out of here! Alright. I think these are gonna be fake too. It's all fake over here, man. I'm gonna go look up top. Oh, I can't trust any of these holes. Dude, what? Oh my lord. I'm just gonna go inside here really quick just to verify that there is a crafting table. You can't pick up anything off of someone's house on their floor, so I just need to see that there's a crafting table. Yeah, three of them, great. Okay, so I think what I need to do is I need to find like one stone and then I can get a flimsy axe. If I find one stone floating around, are you kidding me? Wow. Yes! Okay! And I need one iron nugget, too. I don't know. I don't honestly know if I need that. No, I'm good. I found my stone, so I can go get my flimsy axe. And then I can go back to the trees. I can make myself... Yeah, yeah, I can, I can do all that. Here we go. Okay. That's really all I needed. Um, I need to go chopping some trees now. Come on. There we go. Dude, stop! I was gonna see if I can get that. Alright. Uh, so, here we go. I'm gonna do this. Because it's nearby, right? I don't really have to go that far. I need five, five, and five. Uh, actually, I need four, four, and four. I hope I get lucky with RNG over here, because if I don't get lucky with RNG on this stuff, then I'm done. Come on, guy, pick it up. I gotta check my Nook Miles Plus um, stuff right now. I have uh, four, four, six. No, I need a little bit more. I swear if this thing breaks and I have bad RNG, I'm gonna be upset. I saw a couple trees over here. Hey, dude. Yo, that's not cool. Are you kidding me? Get this guy out of here. Look at this little cheater. Yo, if he steals that, I'm gonna be upset. Oh my gosh. What? A, who is this guy? Okay, that's cheap, dude. I need to find you. Okay, so I got 557. I need softwood. I need more softwood. Don't be a bad boy? Yo, tell him to drop it. Uh, I need more softwood. I need five more softwood. Are you kidding me?
Get out of here! That better be regular wood. Yeah, softwood's the light one. I'm pretty upset now. If that guy took softwood, I'm gonna be upset. And I don't know how many hits on my stuff. There's one softwood. I guess a strategy over here is to definitely rob all the trees. Dude, it's over! That's all my branches! Ah, <sighs> and I don't have enough softwood. I need a lot. I need four, four, and four. And then now I need more branches. I need another uh, uh, piece of stone. Thank you. So now I need to dig up another stone <clears throat> and get some more softwood, and that's annoying. What are these over here? These are pretty conspicuous. Huh, I think it's only- it's faster if I just fall into it. Oh, good, thanks. One? It's not the one I needed, but I'll take it. Yo, you took two. stone man let's go hey hey we're in business now good 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 let's go get another one and then I'm just gonna go if I have to I'm gonna go all the way over there I'm gonna make a ladder I don't know what the ladder is gonna do me for right now but I'm just gonna make it so I have it in my inventory um, yeah let's craft we're gonna make the I'm going to make the flimsy axe. I had very bad RNG, but this is good because no one can chop those trees now. And vaulting pole. I think the vaulting pole would be a little bit better right now, to be honest. I don't know if I need the ladder. I'm gonna go see what I could do with a vaulting pole, to be honest. Um, I think I could just go downstairs right now. I think I go downstairs to that water area and then vault over. What's that? What does that say? Only one shovel found? Oh, dang! <clears throat> Only one shovel found. Yo, get on my level right now. I'm figuring this out. Thanks for that heads up. I love that temperature check. Um, <clears throat> what is this? Oh, did I go with the wrong item? So what do I need over here? I need to somehow... Can I not vault across? Hold on, hold on, let me, let me test something here.
Look up. Oh, I can't. I can't touch this. Not unless I have the ladder, and I didn't have the good RNG with the stupid axe, so I need to go all the way back to the forest in order to ladder my way up there. And I've never actually been this way. I'm very much ahead, though. I knew I needed the ladder, too. Ugh. Why did I come this way? I know the way back. Where am I? I should have gone a long way. Honestly, I should have. This is a big waste of time. You know, I'm going back. I got time. They have to go, they have to honestly go all the way. Dude, where am I? What in the actual world? I gotta call the rescue service. Can I call the rescue service? Okay, okay, that's a shortcut, cool. Alright, I just need soft wood, man. Let's go. There we go, one soft wood. Beautiful. I'm gonna make sure to pick up all these so no one else has them. Yo, Ashley's stuck. Get stuck. Yeah, that's some soft wood right there. All right, here we go. Do I have enough? <clears throat> I need four, four, four. I have enough. Four, four, four for the ladder. I'm out. So I got to make my way to the crafting table. Yeah, dude, I got this. I absolutely got this. I think this is the way to Raymond. Unless someone's ahead of me in this, I don't know. Oh, how did I get through here? terrible at mazes still anyone's game no I don't I don't know man once I get that ladder crafted I'm out of here <clears throat> I forgot how to do the little thing is racing a mile a minute right now. <clears throat> Alright, here we go. Craft, craft, craft. Let's craft. <clears throat> We're gonna go ladder time. All done, baby. I should throw the flimsy shovel down for someone, right? Wouldn't that be a nice little gesture? Dude, why am I going this way? <laughs> it's getting to my head.
Can't get too, uh, too ahead of yourself, right? How do I get over there? Maybe I... Are boxes in the way? Hold on, hold on. I didn't actually make it over there. What? Look up. I can't pull vault over that way. I'm so close! There has to be something else. Oh, can I just ladder over here? These boxes are in the way. How do I get up there? It has to be like a different way. I don't know. Like, how do I... There's gotta be something else over here. Something that I'm missing. Can I get down here? I'm not seeing this. My heart is racing. I thought I had this. Oh gosh, is that that easy? Yeah, boy! Yeah, boy! <laughs> yeah, buddy! Oh man, he is mine! <laughs> Game over, baby! Woo! Yeah! To the victor go the spoils! That's how we do it! That's how we do it! Yeah! Yo! Yo, best Animal Crossing! Get over here! Yo, Raymond, what's up? I heard so much about you. Oh my gosh. You should move to my island, guy. <laughs> oh man. Yo, we got Raymond. Yeah, dude. <laughs> That's my favorite emote. Dude. That was crazy. Absolutely bonkers. That was absolutely bonkers, man. <laughs> what a cool thing, man. Yo, the race for Raymond 2020, guess. Bow down to me, your Animal Crossing King! I'm gonna take the middle throne here. 
Yo. The race for Raymond. Oh man. Yo, I got Raymond. He thinks he got Raymond. He knows he's got it now. I got the Raymond. And he is all mine. He doesn't belong to you. Cause he belongs to me. Let's get that Raymond cat. Raymond cat all day. <laughs> Let's get that Raymond cat, the Raymond cat all day. He's the king of the maze, and he beat everyone down, 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 down. Let's get that Raymond. He is my Raymond. Let's get that Raymond. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <clears throat> What's tickets up front? Yo, this kid stole my wood. <laughs> Yo, this kid stole my wood. <laughs> oh. <clears throat> Remember when this kid stole my wood? That was really good. <clears throat> I love the Raymond song. That was cool. Nook Miles tickets. To the victor go the spoils. That was so good. <clears throat> Okay. <laughs> so if we're leaving, I'm out. And here's a taunt. <laughs> There's a taunt of a pitfall seed. <laughs> Here, take this. Wow, I wasted a lot of time digging that stuff up. But like, you think about it? You think about it, right? <laughs> that was so cool. You needed some know-how. Like, you have to know how Animal Crossing works. And I think that's what really put me ahead of the competition, was I, I saw some areas of things that you may have needed. I saw the crafting area, and I'm like, okay, obviously we got a lot of water here, you got a, a ladder, we're gonna need some stuff. And then, like, I saw the area with the trees, I'm like, okay, obviously this is where we're gonna get the wood in order to craft everything. And then the moment that I saw that there were four tools up top, I knew I had to get over there. So, man, I was the first one to get the shovel. Uh, I shook for the branches because I knew I needed a flimsy axe in order to get wood for potentially the, um, the vaulting pole and the ladder. And then I just went over there. I could have finished it way quicker if I had good RNG on softwood, but I didn't. 
That was really cool. That was absolutely really cool. There were no fruits. I was really hoping that there would be some fruits that I can just dig up a tree and then plant it in someone's way to completely block them. Of course, because that's the kind of competitive player I would, like, I would totally try to deter someone from moving on. Um, but, yeah. That was cool. That was really cool. Alright, so let's go see what's going on with Raymond. Everybody loves Raymond. Wee! It's nighttime! Oh my gosh, did this time overlap? No, 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 I was gonna say, did the time overlap to the next day? So now I got an automatic villager in my town? Yeah, the spot is reserved for Raymond's new home. Oh, beautiful, beautiful. Let's get out of here. Let's get out of here. Let's go say hi to Raymond and we're gonna end the video. This is so intense. Oh, I was so like adrenaline. My adrenaline was pumping in that one. You know what that reminded me of? That reminded me of the Animal Crossing. No, I'm sorry, not Animal Crossing. The Super Mario Maker 2 Invitational. Uh, that happened in 2019. Remember, if you guys have looked it up, just do a quick Google or a YouTube search, Super Mario Maker 2 Invitational Abdallah. Um, and then you can see exactly what I went through. It was a completely b blind competition going in and playing levels in Mario Maker 2. And I ended up winning that uh, competition and just going in completely blind, knowing any nothing about it. And then just, just going off of the general know-how of how I know how to play games and figure things out. Like, I ended up winning it. So I had that exact same adrenaline rush. And I haven't had that adrenaline rush in a long time. So, shout out to the people that made this entire island. Because your entire island's trashed. It truly is. Just for one thing, and one thing only, and that's to give away a Raymond like that. But, you know what's pretty cool is that you can just rebuild it, and then you can, you can invite some other people in. Provided you change up a couple of things, if they're just gonna search my video. Um... Yeah, that was absolutely stunning, to say the least. Absolutely stunning. They did an awesome job. Okay, 7.30. We have a new front in our island. Let's give a big A Nation welcome to Raymond. Round of applause emojis. Oh, so cool, man. I love this. This is so much fun. All right, congrats, Raymond. I'm sure you'll enjoy island life here. Yeah. And with that, I'll get b back to work supporting you and your enjoyment. So much fun. All right, let's go say hi to him. And I'm still in this red uniform, man. Let's go. What's up, my guy? Hey, hey, what's up? Hey, so Abdallah, uh, I did some real thinking about what we talked about before, and you're right. I should totally live here on the island with you and your friends. So, I'm here, and I'm gonna start living that island life right now. Beautiful, beautiful. Let me push you over here. Uh, let's do a little bit of a smile for the camera. Is he not going to do anything? Do you do anything if I emote at you? Oh, so good. And then is he over here? Can we go to Harv's Island and take some pictures? We might, but I think the live stream is done. Like, there's really nothing else to do besides take some pictures on. If he's actually on my board. Yeah, he is. He's over here. So this is his house. This is great. So we have Raymond. Uh, and yeah, we're all set, man. So ladies and gents, I'll go take some pictures on Harv's Island of Raymond and I'll I'll definitely do it. I'll take a look at my inventory too, all these free DIYs that are just kind of there. And then we did get the uh the Raymond poster too, so it's crazy, man. It's super crazy. Okay, guys. Well, thanks so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did enjoy the video, be sure to leave a like and of course, shout outs to uh, our friends who have made this entire island puzzle maze. It was so crazy. It was so like articulate and there was a lot of thought involved in it. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I don't think there's ever going to be a better maze than that. 
you guys try and then invite me over and then put another villager over there as the prize in boxes and I'll come over and beat it for you. <laughs> oh my gosh, that was so awesome. Anyway, thanks for watching. Uh, if you guys enjoyed the video, be sure to leave a like. Uh, be sure to smash that like button. Share the video with a friend. Uh, consider subscribing for the latest and greatest Animal Crossing New Horizons content on YouTube. And we'll see you guys on the next one. It's been a great time. On screen, there's going to be some tips and tricks tutorial videos. And you'll also see the newest upload on my channel. So definitely go take a look at that. Take care and have a great day.